and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate video, guys. And today, we got the brand new House Rules. Now, you might have just saw my flashback video go up. EA didn't even say anything. They announced on a Monday. I was not ready for this. I had my flashback video ready up. So now I'm kind of pissed because now my flashback video is going to get blown out the water because now I have to get the, I'm going to get this one up. This one's definitely probably more important now. You guys are probably going to care about this a lot more. Kind of upset. I like to do this on Tuesdays and now it's today, guys. But I'm going to try to get through all this as quickly as possible. Get this out to you guys. I hopefully like 1130. See if we can get this out for you guys. It does kind of suck the timing of it all, but it is what it is, guys. We got to deal with what comes our way when it comes to Madden because Madden can never ever keep a schedule going now we got the new house rules objective so let's go check this out real quick it is rumble and rumble loss of down why are there two what the hell all right so i guess these are the base rewards and then the other ones the the second reward so one win is 10 trophies 5,000 coins five wins is 10,000 trophies 5,000 coins 10 wins is 10,000 trophies 5,000 coins 25 wins is 10,000 trophies 5,000 coins 45 wins is 10,000 trophies 5,000 coins and it seems to be the same all the way to 130 wins wow that is a lot of wins now guys before we get into this video and we continue going make sure to go down below hit that subscribe button turn that notify bell boys come join the family i appreciate each and every one of you that come out here every day hopefully i have this video for you guys up soon comment down below all your opinions on this as we get through the video as it comes about and guys can we get over 100 likes on the 10:30 video like i said in my flashback video you guys never really get 100 likes on the 10:30 video can you guys smash the like button i don't know if you can do it but if you're watching smash it let's see if we can do it guys a little challenge for you guys now let's continue so 135 wins that kind of scares me 130 wins now i'm scared what do we get i i'm kind of scared to see this welcome to rumble win in any rumble event to make progress towards a random series redux player so it's a series redux player this event ends on november 17th at 10 30 eastern time now if i had to guess 11 17 might be the day that the thanksgiving promo starts considering that's when the house rules ends now this one think fast all drives are now first and 20 you get two points for every first down but you only have three attempts to get one looking for a quick game catch an interception catch an interception for an instant win start racking up wins to earn a random series redux player Guys, I do not know how I feel about this. 130 wins for a random series redux. And if I get Phillip Rivers, I swear to God, I will freak out, guys. This is kind of scary. Let's go over to a head-to-head -head season to go show the house rules cards and quickly see what, what this is all about. So we got Rumble, Loss of Down. Why is Tug of War still there? Rumble, Loss of Down. Let's get into this. Whew. Let's go read the... Oh, okay. I always forget that I can just be right here. So our house rules, rumble loss of down, our house rules, our rules, 130 total wins, any random, any rumble event can only be earned once. Yeah, as if anyone's playing 260 games to get a random series redux player. Now it's 350 coins per game, obviously. And the, and the same, what I don't like is the rewards are the same to 10 to the 130 wins. The coin reward should definitely be higher than 5k. If you played 130 games, you get 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. If my math is correct, it is about 60k worth of coins and 60 trophies. No. Oh, yeah, that was really dumb. 60, 120 trophies. That is really dumb, guys. I don't know why we'd get 120 trophies as the only. We should get definitely more for 130 games. I'm not the biggest fan of how many games it's going to take. I might hop into a game real quick to show you guys how quickly this can be done. Now, my tips, right? If it's instant win or interception, blitzing might not be the worst thing because you could force them to make quick reads that they might not usually make. Uh, first and 20 attempts at a first down obviously i'm gonna hop into a game probably so you guys can have a pretty good idea of what we could potentially do in this let's hop into it real quick now guys my overall consensus on this what do i think too many wins we complained about 50 wins right we we're like too much they made it 75 we complained about that they made it like 80 we complained about that they make it 130 they keep increasing it you know what it is they're probably seeing how high they can make it on so where people will actually stop playing them completely which i think is ridiculous that they're going that route but that kind of seems to be exactly what they're doing now personally am i mad that we're getting a series next player no but just they bet it better not be 90 overalls right because that, that'd be annoying if i play 130 games and i get philip rivers like that's not cool it better it should be at least guaranteed above a 91 that'd be awesome that'd make it worthwhile but i don't know if the grind's worth the potential chance of getting not one of those players do not let your opponent intercept the ball intercept the ball win all right so as i play this i'm gonna give you guys some tips for how to play this obviously you guys can see a little bit of my scheme here do i recommend do I, do I like i personally recommend doing anything yet not exactly i have to obviously see how this game plays first let's see 
Let's see. Let's see. I'm not gonna. I'm not really gonna cut much of this because obviously I want you guys to see what we have to do. So yeah, it's gonna probably be a run heavy mode this week because people don't want to throw a pick. It is first and twenty though, which is also gonna. You need first downs in this. So Tampa two. I'll probably give him a little blitz real quick. He's going to probably keep doing. She's gonna probably stretch the hell out of me. So let's see where the stretch is going. Let's spread the line. No, he's he's audible and out of that. Let's see. Let's see. So personally, from what I'm seeing on first glance, people might try to run the hell out of you again this week. Oh. So, if they're going to be running the hell out of you, that's fine, because unless they break big runs, they're going to have struggles, because you can't just get six yards a game, because that's still won't be enough for a first down. They're going to have to have a pretty good offense game plan. I'm going to... Oh, I'm run committing. This might, go, might not go too well. Oh, we got it, we got it, we got it, we stopped him. So, you have to get it within three downs, so there we go. I took it back from him. So, honestly, blitzing might be the move. You have a decent chance of stopping the run. And then if they need to, they can't really develop plays downfield because you're blitzing. So they're going to have to keep everything within front of you and short. And with that being said, they need to get, it's, it's, third, and, it's third and 20. You can only get three downs and 20, you need 20 yards. So that might be the move. Sending the pressure this week. Let's see. He's sending the pressure on me. Obviously, I'm going to be able to break that run every time. Uh, let's try to pass out. Let's see. Let's see what kind of run, like what kind of defense you can be sitting in. If he's sitting in, man, this should be just fine. I should have ran the other play, actually. My personal thoughts, though, this shouldn't be that hard of a game mode to play. Although, you do need a pick. So, like, what if you don't get it? Oh, you start in the fourth quarter, though. Okay. These games actually really aren't that bad. I got George Kittle right, wide open right there. Should be a touchdown. There we go. Two minute warning. Okay, two points. Oh, so that's pretty much it. And then you can just, you can just chew clock. All right. Chew clock right there. So, this is not that bad. I recommend you guys get your first first down and then start chewing clock. That's it. Chew clock. Run out the clock. And then also. Don't throw a pick. Evan. Once you get your once you get your lead, I'll definitely make a video tomorrow going for over for you guys. The best way to finish this. But once you get your lead, I highly recommend you just chew clock, run the ball, and keep your lead. Think about it. That's game right there. That's game. He's quitting. Okay, guys. There you go. You saw it firsthand. The best strategy, in my opinion, get your first down, chew clock, run the ball out, and then if you score, you score. If you don't, he won't have much time left, and just don't pass the ball. Because if you give him a pick, he wins. So I'd recommend once you get if you're tied, go for the passing. But if you're losing. Or anything. No, I mean, if you're winning or tied, go for the running game. If you're losing, then pass. You got nothing to lose. But obviously, whoever gets the ball first is kind of going to dictate a lot of the game. So if you get the ball first, it should be a pretty easy dub, in my opinion. If you're good at offense, one first down is literally nothing, and you can easily chew the clock out. They only have three timeouts. Well, that's what they start with. But I, I, I really, I honestly, this house could go pretty fast. That game was insanely quick. I don't think it's going to be horrible, but 130 wins. It's still going to take like 10 hours. There's no way around it not taking 10 hours. It's 130 wins. But maybe not the worst. I mean, no, it's pretty bad. 130 wins kind of sucks, guys. I will make a video for you guys going over in depth after my overall opinions of this on what I think you should be doing. The best strategy to finish this as quickly as possible so you can get your free Redux player. Hopefully, I have this video out for you guys within about 25 minutes from this time recording. I don't know when I'm going to find the time to play all these houses. There's going to be so many. I have to play like 40 games a day. Looking like no COD this week, boys. Looking like not a COD week. Now, for the Redux players, who do you want to get out of these real quick? You want to, you want a Mutt 10 player, realistically. I mean, to get your to get your money back, like your time invested back, in my opinion, you need at least a 91 overall pull. And even then, that might be not be enough. Let's go to Series Redux real quick. I'm going to show you guys where I think that line gets drawn. Pretty much anything that you're about to see right here is ass. You don't want any of this. None of this. You're going to you're gonna have to pretty much get a 91. Even the 91 might not be enough. No. You're going to have to start from right about here. I need at least 400k. Like I need from Camara up to really justify it. And obviously, with all these free Redux players, these cards should be coming down quite a bit. So it's going to be a great time to probably buy these in a few days. I want a Mutt 10 player. That's the goal. If we get a Mutt 10 player, guys, we more than for sure justify all the time we spent into this. So that'd be pretty awesome if we could get that. It's kind of sad, guys. I'm about, to, I'm about to wash my flashback video out of the water because I obviously have to post this. I'm upset. I wish I would have seen this, guys. I'm pretty hyped about it, too, but... Who knows if I'll even do it. I gotta, it's gonna take a lot of time, a lot of videos to do. Hopefully, all you working guys and all you school guys, I feel so bad for you guys. I know you guys wanna have to grow, you're gonna wanna grind this. All the no money spent guys. Uh, I believe it should be Nat. And in that case, it should be a fantasy pack. In my opinion, it should be a three player fantasy pack. Give us a chance to get something good. Don't screw us, EA, but that's probably what they're gonna do, guys. But that's about it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to the channel, make sure to go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn that notification bell, boys. Come join the family. Like I always say, comment down below. If you Give me some feedback on the video. I greatly appreciate all, all your feedback all the time. And guys, it's a 1030 video. Back-to-back -back 1030 videos. Can you guys smash that like button? Get this video to 300 likes. Come on, boys. I don't know if you could do it, but I'm challenging you guys to do so. Start smashing the second you start watching, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out. See you guys next video. Peace.